Hey there, Titans. I'm your host, Eric Resendiz, and welcome to Titan Weekly, your information source for the latest news, trends, and events going on this week. Starting off with some campus news, as college students, we've all heard about the dreaded freshman 15. The idea that freshmen, due to poor diet choices, tend to gain about 15 pounds. Well, if you're a registered freshman and are looking to avoid gaining a little extra weight, head on over to the Student Recreation Center. Starting in March, the Student Recreation Center here at CSUF will offer free personal training to registered freshmen in this judgment-free environment. Freshmen can learn the right way to work out and keep off the weight. There will also be a boot camp on March 9th from 5.30 p.m. to 6.30 p.m. on the Tuffy Lawn. And if you feel sleepy after those morning early classes or after lunchtime, and you just wish you could take a nap somewhere on campus, well, join CSUF on March 8th and 9th on the ECS Lawn. Come take a nap from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. and get the rest you desperately need in the midst of midterm exams. Now, let's turn to our community. If you're looking for a place to study for midterms and get some quality coffee nearby, then there's some good news. Drip Coffee in downtown Fullerton finally opened up last week. The coffee shop is located on the corner of Chapman and Harbor and offers a comfortable and calm environment for anyone looking to meet with friends or study for exams. Drip is open as early as 8 a.m. and has late hours until midnight on weekends. Perfect for your coffee run in the morning or those late night study sessions. And now the Oscars, the most talked about event of this past weekend, and perhaps the event fans won't stop talking about for a while, Leonardo DiCaprio's long overdue Oscar win. The actor won his first ever golden statue for Best Actor in The Revenant. The film was directed by Alejandro González Iñárritu, who won the award for Best Director for the second year in a row. Red carpet fashion at the Academy Awards also gave us much to discuss. Celebrities such as Alicia Vikander, Kate Winslet, and Lady Gaga were some of the best dressed at Hollywood's swankiest night, according to People magazine. Classy bold colored gowns seem to be the most popular choice amongst female celebrities, but we also saw some jewel-toned gowns like green, purple, and blue. And there were a variety of hairstyles such as Tina Fey's sleek updo and Lady Gaga's soft and classic curls. That's all we have this week for Titan Weekly. Tune in next time.